decided to have a little walkabout today. It is absolutely stifling hot, isn't it? But it's lovely, absolutely gorgeous. Got a lovely little um, cafe there. Pinguino Cafe. Look at the little guy on his moped, how cute is that? Absolutely so sweet. Oh my gosh. This is what, this is what I can smell the love. I love that. Marvellous lover. Oh, it smells absolutely gorgeous. Quite a few nice little handbags in there. Look at these. The leather is just unbelievable. Gorgeous, in fact. I actually, uh, I feel like one of these plants at the moment. Sweltering like that. But I'm sure it's gonna be a lovely little walk. We're just getting a few, uh, few snaps there, are we? Very nice. But look at this as we're walking up now. You can come too. Gorgeous is that. Got a few people swimming in the sea over there. I think I'd like to go and swim in the sea. Would you like to swim in the sea with me one day? Oh yeah. Fancy swimming in the sea? Definitely. Look at my suntan. <laughs> That's the best it's got at the moment. Some nice little hats here again. So I've been looking all over for Neil. Oh, look at those little beagles. Look there. Been looking absolutely everywhere for him. And I finally found him. He always wanders off. And here he is. How's that? It's just a uh, rubby belly for good luck. Let's hope we get some good luck coming. So we're, uh, we're, we're going off up to where the mosaics are today, aren't we? Mosaic? The mosaics. Mosaic. So we're, I don't know if we picked the right time of day to go because it's getting on for the middle of the day. And, and only mad dogs and Englishmen go out in the midday sun, don't they? Yeah. But we're going to have a look anyway. Hang on a minute, does that mean I'm the mad dog and you're the Englishman? Yeah, you're mad dog, I'm the Englishman. <laughs> Photos It's a very good experience because this iguana is outside before five years they're in the cage. Was it? I, I retrieved. Do you mind if I record? You yeah. want to do photos? We do for the donation. Yeah, I'll do a donation. Yeah. I'll do a donation. You need to relax. No need to be afraid. This is the experience we will do this before in your life. Yes? Wow. This is the Caribbean. This is the Mexico. Which Caribbean? Yeah. Wow, look at that. Thank you. Okay. <laughs> wow, Liz, that Liz, Lizzie the lizard. Uh, iguana live in the America, Mexico, Florida, Galapagos Island. This is the Caribbean. This is the Mexico. <laughs> iguana live in the tree because we the gym. Oh, right. uh, slight, this is uh, kind of weird. Adrenaline. I don't know if you. Yeah, I don't want him to fall. No, no, he's okay. What's his name? This is the Sparta, this is the Enneas. <laughs> Sparta? Iguana want to be free. Like this, possibly to react. Maybe coming dog, coming something. How old is he? This is the four years, this is the seven. And is this a male or a female? Two males. Two males. And we swim, this is the gills for the swimming. Oh, you swim? This is the ear. And what is special for these reptiles? You have three eyes. What? It's here. No. Yes, it's here. In and the middle? Yeah. Oh, he's going to go. <laughs> because I don't for this third time. Ah. That's okay. It, it's here. Did he get jealous? Well, the third eye. Yes, this is connection in the universe, so connection in the yeah. sky oh, and the sun. sun. This is what you're holding on to me, isn't it? Oh, it's going. 
Yeah. 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 Yeah.
I can't lie. <laughs> I am absolutely struggling in this heat. To be honest with you, it is unbelievably stifling. I've already drunk two bottles of water. So I'm keeping hydrated. Can't find a hat to fit because I've got such a pea head. Absolutely boiling. Don't get me wrong, I'm so grateful for the weather. I'm so grateful to be here. I've got a nice breeze at the moment, so I am keep walking towards the breeze, which is literally a beautiful sea breeze. Look at that. How cool is that? I've left Neil up at the, uh, the viewing point taking photos. Got some lovely sea view there. Absolutely stunning. You can only imagine what it was like 2,000 years ago. Just incredible. Absolutely incredible. Look at them fields. This, so this area goes, it's pretty vast. Yep, Liz is walking off. I think she's suffering a little bit in the heat. She wanted me to leave her where the iguanas were. <laughs> Look, she's right down there vlogging. I must say, Cyprus is a really, really pretty country. Paphos is beautiful, absolutely beautiful. It's that, it is that nice here that my thoughts are even closed off. Holding that iguana, oh, I felt such a connection to it. It was so gorgeous, it really was. So now I want one. Look at this. I think this is all Roman, this area, but the games were probably held down in this area. I'm not sure, I'm gonna try and find out what that was for. Um, but you can see it's like an amphitheater style seating over there. There is a message board, but I don't know if we're gonna get down there to have a look, to be honest. We'll see. So we've just popped into uh the vending area because it is absolutely boiling isn't it so yeah. my shoulders are boiling so we've just popped in to get some more water and we're sitting by a lovely little bit of a breeze yeah let us know in the comments um the best gear for riding in extreme heat i mean we're talking like this is like topping 40 degrees at the moment so i, I just don't think my oxford um gear is it's gonna cut it. No, far too hot. So there must be something that's really lightweight, really flexible. Um, you know you've got that that um, that armor now that's like the, very uh, thin. The mesh, like the uh... mesh armor. <sighs> Must have been something else. What happened? What happened to all these people? The house of Dionysus, was it? Dionysus. Lovely. Let's go. 